Steph, what, what was your mi mindset starting the fourth quarter down eight? Maybe everything wasn't going the way you guys had wanted. What was your think thinking going in that? Um, I mean, it's a, it a weird vibe, you know, dealing with, I'll call it some nerves and, you know, anxiousness to try to take care of business, knowing how important this game was to win, you know, first three quarters, two and a half quarters, uh, you could tell that like, we were kind of pressing a little bit. They were obviously, Jokic was playing amazing. Um, and they had a lot of life in that third quarter, and it was a good reminder of, again, how hard it is to win a playoff game, how hard it is to, you know, close a team out, and just dealing with, you know, the uh, the nerves of it all because it matters so much, and I think we wanted it so much, kind of got in our way, our got in our own way a little bit, and then, you know, fourth quarter is just about can you find a way to just get it done, get enough stops to speed up the game a little bit, put some pressure on them. And we were able to do that. Obviously, everybody contributed. It was a it was a fun fun way to finish the game, considering all that's happened this year with the lineup that we had out there, GP doing his thing on both ends of the floor. You know, Draymond and Loon providing a good presence for us inside. Uh, Otto coming up big. It was just exactly not exactly how you would draw it up but it was you know a playoff type of environment where it's just can you get the win and get out of here gary barely made the roster w was there a moment you knew like oh that guy can help us win playoff games like maybe early in the season seems so long ago but like november was a while just how he was making his presence felt bringing a lot of energy athleticism um on both ends of the floor his defensive awareness and impact so you knew like it was he was capable of doing that and but it's also like the unknown of this group being you know in this situation for the first time and the playoffs brings the best and worst out of you um and like look at his impact this series if i'm not mistaken the first two games you know he played a little bit but you know, wasn't he had an impact, but it wasn't like tonight. Game three, he was amazing in the first half. He was pretty much perfect in his minutes. You know, game four didn't really have you know that opportunity, and then he comes back and finishes off a, a series clinching game. So it's, it's how we do things. You know, everybody has to be ready, but he you know, really made his presence felt and showed, you know, what he's capable of, and he's going to continue to do that, especially with whoever we play next round. Stephen, in a game like this where, you know, the Nuggets were coming after you guys really hard early on and physical, um, a lot of fouling, got choppy, grimy. How valuable a tool is a guy like Gary? I mean, he fills a lot of different roles, and he's tough to – if he's making you know his, his catch and shoot threes, he's tough to game plan against because you put probably your big on him. Um, he can roll. He obviously he was rolling to the basket, pick and rolls, finishing at the rim. He made those two clutch threes. So what he gives us on defense is amazing already. And then when you put teams in different positions on offense, you know when they're defending us and he's kind of roaming all over the place and using his quickness. Um, you know, to his advantage, it's it's pretty pretty impactful. He even made a play, I think, where he turned out a three pump fake, drove down, uh, dropped down past the Draymond for for a finish. So you could tell as a guy that's been around the the game in terms of it's in his DNA, and he uh, he looked very composed out there in a very big moment. Steph. 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 All right, that was Stephen Curry. He scored 30 points tonight in game number five, a clinchy game against the Denver Nuggets. Do not forget, moving forward, Warriors Live Playoff Edition before and after every single game this postseason, only on NBC Sports Bay Area. We're going to hear from the Dove Salt crew on the other side as Warriors will await the winner of the 